Oh, oh he's rank one, is that why? Member So, on tonight, I've heard about a new a new player on the ranks who's uh, using K Dash. He's the only player to use K Dash, and I actually find K Dash to be something inside to him. Like the way he can just safely rush in and out and just basically approach someone's effective area or zone and then just phase completely out. And I tend to gravitate a lot towards these characters, these fast paced characters. And he's going with a, technic a very technical team. It's not often I see Angel being played. But Angel's a very uh, tic tac toe kind of character, and he's definitely got the best character when you're yeah. he's using her first. So let's see how she fares against a character I believe to be just as good in the game or fantastic. As good. <laughs> Sorry about my simulants. <laughs> when any girl he would sit down with something like a Pistorus, you know what I'm saying? Yes. A lot of extensive combinations and words all try to do it together. <laughs> and no, you see, no, I can't use whip at all, really. Arnold, can you take comfort for a second? Get back in a minute. The yeah, other definitely keeps whip out of reach with those explosive grenades. That she's able to dish out anyone. Does she have a better neutral game than Whip? That can't be. Oh, I can definitely see why she's the best in the game. Hugo definitely uses her to a very explosive degree. <laughs> but what counts is... Gungus uses a lot of his super arts. And he has the hit confirms to, to match. Ooh, Angel. Let's come down to both players using the second character. <laughs> I do believe I managed to let out of uh, a And that was a very, very dangerous Ralph. He was able to take a good 60, 68% of his health. Unable to keep up with that burst damage. While Grimless was able to use the best degree of damage in that highly optimized combo. And now we're here to see the highly impressionable K. Ego Seeker has been using him effectively in and out. And I'm here to see it for the first time tonight. Well, if Grimless is able to keep up the hit confirms that he's been doing previously, being able to optimize his combos and do an impressionable 70% each time, and he is able to plot him out and use his critical art the best time ever. That's definitely the impressionable K that I've been hearing about today. And we're back on in the conference call. This K dash is something impressive. Oh, really? Yeah, it's uh, number one, uh, Clark. And Grimness is literally on K's case. He's dashing in towards him, and he's just fucking up, and 
Gigos made a very gross mistake, but looks like Grimness made just one one just as bad. Unfortunately that critical R didn't also in time. But <laughs> wow, he's able to cancel he's able to barge him out of it. He had the critical art to end all means, but he probably used the wrong critical arts in this case. Because Grimness concedes with that win. Well, our four top win. That was something like a good game. Yeah. Both, both players were able to use their characters to the best of their degrees, optimize their combos. And something that Digo is able to excel in is his ability to put a player in the position that he wants them to. And just be able to approach anyhow he likes. Let's see, let's see how does that vision in the game. And the match between these two. Both players playing the characters very intensely. What I'm seeing mostly scrambles, and that's a lot of meter gained on both parties. Leona is definitely something fierce, but the way he uses her is highly defensive. We must be able to use Whip to have complete effectiveness due to Leona's just amazing special moves. Not even amazing buttons, like her special moves are just, wow, just keeps you in the, keeps you out of boundaries. Yeah, out of the game today. She's definitely a momentum killer, but Whip was able to proceed by using the last of her meter. Ego didn't necessarily have the most impressionable aim for the last game. He wasn't able to establish a game or any of her connectives. But this is something highly unusual. He's decided to first quit from her neutral, which is a very bad idea, but you know, her health is so low that it doesn't even matter. He definitely has the meter for it, that's for sure. And that was the sickest, sickest trade indeed. I didn't have to use his meter due to the local. But Ralph is definitely going to keep on her toes. He's almost is able to take a huge chunk out of his cover. And he's looking to do that right now, but unfortunately he fell short of the maximum as he fell in vain. But he goes definitely not with the pressure. Really came with an answer. That answer is putting Deeper on the corner. Ego uses his desires to use the evasiveness to the highest degree. Is it a case where he could be too evasive? He's allowing Grimms to fade. And Grimms could actually concede with the pressure. That was a very impressive counter attack. Let's see if it turns the time of the game. He wouldn't entirely. But another counter attack and he could get up in the game. Angel is trying to use all her guns and it could cost her the next round. Okay, that's needing requiring as much as it did. I see an imminent max mode approaching. Deciding on something to get there. Okay, that's was able to jump over Ralph entirely after a whip ground attack. And somehow oh, that missed. But yeah, the different have to optimize the combos to the best degree, but Lewis is definitely good with the execution. And he's definitely good at the conversions. And that com and the conversion definitely cost him. Yeah. One it becomes a lot less intense when Grimmel has been able to adapt. Being able to adapt to Diego's assertiveness. 
and counteract him. Everything that Bruno is supposed to do. Oh, we're gonna see a tricky character. I'm gonna be very, very happy to see Vanessa being played, but unfortunately he's on the on the HUD for just long enough that just uh played my games with me. Wait, I'm seeing Vanessa play. <laughs> yes you are. <laughs> Right, so we'll put King first, Clark last. I'm fairly confident in this team. It seems like King Grimless is very confident in using King first. He has been known to use Vice as a sniper. So he's just uh, very so he tries to preserve it as well. Nico is using Vanessa almost like an experiment. But this is something that is definitely hard to answer. And he's not able to really assert anything because he's so far away. He's just too far away that he's deceiving himself. Open. He's just leaving himself open to each and every one of the things on the hot kick. Let's see how he fares from here. Because right now, he's in the corner. He's able to use that sound very effectively. And keep on the pressure on his good way to concede the ground. He takes the round. Too much pressure from really cracker man. Three, ready, go! 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 One of the other. And it's really good. The owner's been sitting on. The owner's been sitting on a whole lot of projectiles. It's like food sitting on a hot plate. Winner! Yeah, I look like a chicken. Right, so that's me winning that set. I want to go back to the room, see who else wants to go.